Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, we are going to be talking about how 50x of the AMC flow has been shorted, the trapped short margin calls, removing the buy button again, and many more in this video. So make sure you guys watch until the end. Now, straight away, we're taking a look at this. We have had verifiable evidence of AMC shares being sold more than 3x beyond the actual flow. The SEC government still haven't concluded an investigation and the Justice Department hasn't put anyone in prison for obvious criminal market manipulation and illegal naked short selling. From 513 million shares pre-split, over 1.55 billion shares existed between FTX, Bittrex and retail investors alone. This doesn't include institutional ownership, insider ownership, 28% short interest, rehab applications, future contracts, swaps, CDOs, ISDA contracts, short marked as long, naked short, operational short, other synthetic shares, phantom shares, married calls and put, divorced calls and put, tokens held in other crypto brokerages, ETF holdings, and most importantly, failures to deliver. If I had to estimate, I will estimate the AMC float has been sold at least 25 to 50 times beyond the actual number of shares that should exist. So again, we can understand the scope of things for AMC shorts. And again, from what we have seen already, it's already three times beyond the flow. What also isn't mentioned here is again, the synthetic shares that we've seen offshore, where we've seen with the Brazilian ARD, ADR shares held by Citigroup. And that itself would mean that we already have four times the flow from the evidence given. And again, there are a lot more synthetic shares being created offshores. There are a lot more synthetic shares that are being shorted offshore we know that shares that are shorted offshore don't have to be reported so we won't know if they're being shorted and that's why we can conclude the fact that the shares of four amc shorted can be again from 25 to 50 times the flow of amc and so now you can truly understand why shorts are trying to suppress amc why shorts are trying to prevent the cover of amc because if they, if they have to cover they don't have to cover just one times two times three times or four times the flow of amc but rather 50 times the flow of amc and that means that we'll have to pay hundreds of billions of dollars just to cover all of those shorts and again just to make sure that they can survive and that's at the very low price possible that's not at the price where we are willing to obviously sell to them furthermore what we can see is this boss balance is 100 correct amc shorts are trapped and need our shares here is why holding matters why not selling early matters we have a rare chance to remove bad access to save countless future american companies from what amc has gone through in the last three years so what we take a look at this right now is FINRA participants list with a summary of the participants in each category and coming down to a total cap participant of 2,399. And again, the report also showed that reviewed short interest volatility and likely manipulation occurred with other meme stocks in which includes AMC Entertainment. The list of companies that halting trading mentioned in the report included Robinhood, Webull, E-Trade, and again, all of the shares that is obviously here. And so conclusion, in Jan 2021, a small group, 16 out of 2,399 market participants, colluded together and illegally stopped meme buying to reduce their losses. So what does this mean for AMC holders? Well, even now, these short sellers and enabling prime land banks remain trapped with unclosed meme stock short positions. Hold your AMC shares until these bad actors are margin called and liquidated. We have the chance to remove these bad actors so they don't do this to other good American companies. And so this is what go talking about, you know, what we just discussed in here with how big um, of a situation the shorts for AMC is. And again, going to here is that the fact that they are trapped with these amount of shorts they cannot cover remember that it's they're struggling to cover even 100 percent of the flow of amc right now so going back to how truly how big the flow is if they can't even cover one x of the flow of amc what makes you think they can cover 25 and 30 and 50 x of the flow and again people have seen how already again just like we said we know that from everything that isn't concluded, it means that the flow is around 25 to 50 X shorted. But from what we have seen, we've seen it around three to four X, the actual flow of AMC that's actually being shorted. 
Now, to those people who are saying that the shots aren't trapped, that the shots are covered, if they were able to cover four times the flow of AMC, do you realistically think that the price of AMC will be sitting at 4.92? You know, again, going up only 5%, 6% a day, or do you think that if they were to cover 4x the flow of AMC, that the price will already have gone to the hundreds of the thousands and even tens of thousands? So, that's to talk about why it obviously isn't being covered. Now, more on this is why did Robinhood conveniently put 24 5 trading before AMC gets hit hard by shorts, giving people the options to sell overnight in downtrend and finally takes AMC off right when the stock moves up against prior to earnings? Again, this is pretty much removing the buy button again, removed by January bankruptcy label, helping shorts. So what this is is very simple to understand. When they enabled the 24-5 trading, essentially it enabled more liquidity for AMC, but the liquidity was used to put downward pressure for AMC, which meant that, again, if you were able to trade 20, AMC 24-5, every time you saw AMC go down, every time you see uh, AMC being sold, it will imply and give you the incentive to the fact that you should also sell your AMC shares. Because again, a lot of people, when they see the stock goes down, normally they aren't able to do anything. But if you have the ability to trade it 24-5, it's more likely that you will sell your shares. And again, that is giving liquidity towards sell pressure. But now that we see AMC is obviously going up, now that we see AMC is obviously having good um, bullish movement, you can already see today we went from opening with a low at 477 to now up 1% for the day. And again, short and these um, brokerages understand that. They understand the pressure, the buy momentum coming in for AMC right now. That's why they're removing 24.5. Because just like before and previously, they can use and inject liquidity to give downward pressure. It to 24.5 also allows the ability to inject liquidity for upward pressures and that is not what hedge funds want and that's why they stopped and again closed down 24.5 trading and you can see how brokerages are trying to work together to help the shorts as well because there was a big reason for this and that's because brokerages are helping shorts already by lending out shares that firstly they are not supposed to lend out they're lending out shares that again don't even exist they have, they have the ability to use one of the shares you own and lend it out multiple times. So again, what you can understand is one share can be shorted five times, 10 times, 20 times over, and brokers have been doing that, but they want to make sure it doesn't blow up in their face. That's why they're helping short sellers out. Furthermore, what we can see is this. AMC will announce Q4 and full year 2023 earnings, February 28th at 5 p.m. I realize many of you have wanted my take as to what is going on, but the best time to do so on this year ending um, year ending earnings call, listen to the webcast, I will have much to say. Now, this is obviously talking about full year of 2023. And again, Adam Aaron made this earlier, tweeted this earlier today. And when he did tweet these, we actually saw AMC close at a gap down today again like i said of 477. now in this particular tweet alone there is nothing which in sense positive but nor is there anything that implies there's anything negative but yet when he made the tweet instantly it was taken with sell pressure so you can see how short are always trying to do anything they can to suppress the price again the what they're trying to imply right now is Adam Aaron made the tweet, the price go down, which means that it is bad, which means that the earnings report is going to be bad. But we don't have any clue of obviously what's happening. Adam Aaron here has not made anything in suggestion of bad things happening for AMC. All he said is there is much to say. And again, this much to say could be positive. It could be negative. But with what's going on right now, it is more likely positive. But again, we need to be more paying close attention to obviously what he says at February 28th. I do think that it is going to be very, very important because we will understand potentially the long term goal of AMC. We can understand what the move uh, AMC wants to take and many more in this. So that's why I think it's good. Furthermore, in terms of the suppression. So we've seen it with um you know the naked shorts about how government are obviously ignoring that's one type of su suppression we've seen how brokerages are working with um shorts that's one type of suppression another suppression is this 
AMC, another black hole Bitrix sells tokenized stocks too. Someone explained this like I'm three and a half. So this is actually a very, very old post, as you guys can see from 2022, which is talking about the tokens of AMC, which we mentioned earlier. And again, showing 625 million, which was backed one to one. Now, what the reason why I'm bringing this up is because what we can see right now is the particular user has said again, notice how views don't even show up on this post from November 2022. So what it is right now is recently what you guys have seen is obviously with a clip of interview and again how that's being suppressed but that's not only the own that that's not the only thing that's being suppressed what we can see right now is posts like this anything that is talking then uh what short has been using in the past to suppress amc have all been suppressed and again that is to make sure that you forget what happened and you part move on with amc but again that's why we're here to make sure everyone understands what's going on and you guys, thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.